Hey everyone, Big Dan the Bugman here. Welcome back to our channel. Today we're talking about some creepy crawlies you might encounter in Ohio, specifically spiders. From identifying venomous spiders to preventing infestations, we've got you covered. Let's dive right in. Are there any venomous spiders in Ohio? Yes, there are. The two main venomous spiders you might come across are the black widow and the brown recluse. While encounters with these spiders are relatively rare, it's important to know how to identify them and understand their habitats. How can you identify a black widow spider in Ohio? Black widows are distinctive with their shiny black bodies and the iconic red hourglass shape on the underside of their abdomens. They tend to stay in dark, undisturbed places like basements, garages, and wood piles. If you see a spider matching this description, it's best to keep your distance. What is the habitat of the brown recluse spider in Ohio? Brown recluse spiders prefer warm, dry, and secluded areas. You might find them in attics, closets, or behind furniture. They're brown with a violin-shaped marking on their back. These spiders are shy and typically avoid human contact. Are jumping spiders dangerous to humans? Not at all. Jumping spiders are more curious than harmful. They're small, with a stout body and distinctive large eyes. They might give you a little jump scare, but their bites are harmless to humans, and they actually help by eating other pests. What do orb weaver spiders look like? Orb weaver spiders are known for their beautiful, intricate webs. They come in various colors and sizes, often with a bulbous abdomen. These spiders are beneficial for controlling insect populations and are not dangerous to humans. How can homeowners prevent spider infestations in Ohio? To prevent spider infestations, start by keeping your home clean and clutter-free. Seal cracks and gaps in windows and doors and reduce outdoor lighting that can attract insects. Regularly clean and vacuum to remove webs and spiders. What should someone do if bitten by a venomous spider in Ohio? If you suspect a spider bite, especially from a black widow or brown recluse, clean the area with soap and water, apply a cool compress, and seek medical attention immediately. Try to capture the spider safely for identification, but don't delay getting help. How do wolf spiders differ from house spiders? Wolf spiders are larger and more robust, often found hunting on the ground instead of weaving webs. They have excellent vision and are fast runners. House spiders, on the other hand, are smaller with a more delicate build and typically create cobwebs in corners of your home. That's a wrap on today's Spider Talk. If you found this information helpful, make sure to hit the like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more tips on dealing with pests. Thanks for watching and stay safe out there.